Yellowstone quakes intensify as ancient Russian volcano awakens, a planet under pressure. Thousands of earthquakes shake old faithful is Yellowstone stirring? In an unprecedented geologic development, Yellowstone National Park has become the epicenter of rising concern among volcanologists and the public alike. Cool, ...called Ear Spring, and it suddenly started erupting as a geyser. Over 8,000 earthquakes have been recorded around the Old Faithful Geyser Basin. In the past several days alone, an anomaly even in this famously active region. While Yellowstone is no stranger to seismic swarms, the volume, proximity, and unusual energy profiles of these quakes have scientists taking a closer look. Many tremors are occurring at shallow depths of two to five kilometers directly beneath geysers fumaroles, and boiling mud pots. According to the United States Geological Survey, USGS, this seismic unrest is not simply a tectonic event, but may be tied to underground fluid migration and subtle changes in magma activity. We are seeing heightened seismic chatter near, all faithful unlike anything we've recorded in decades, said Dr. Rachel Whitman, a senior geophysicist with the USGS Yellowstone Volcano Observatory. We are not sounding alarms just yet, but we are watching Yellowstone more closely than ever. USGS confirms magma chamber closer to surface. Recent research using magnetotelluric imaging and seismic wave reflection mapping has revealed something even more striking beneath the park. A massive magma reservoir lying closer to the surface than previously thought. The top of the magma chamber, or mush zone, is now estimated to lie just 3.8 kilometers beneath the surface, while only 14% of it is molten. It sits above a much deeper basaltic magma source feeding the system. This upper chamber contains a semi-solid mix of molten rock, crystals, and gas enough to power smaller eruptions or violent hydrothermal explosions under the right conditions. This discovery raises important questions. Is Yellowstone quietly recharging? And could this be a prelude to something larger? What if Yellowstone erupted today? If a major Yellowstone eruption similar to the Lava Creek event 640,000 years ago were to occur today, the consequences would be global. An explosive eruption could eject more than 1,000 cubic kilometers of ash and rock into the atmosphere. Ash would blanket most of North America, severely impacting agriculture, power grids, aviation, and water supplies. Global temperatures could plunge by 2 2 for C causing volcanic winter and mass ecosystem disruption for years.
Unfortunately, there is no immediate sign of such an event. The USGS currently classifies the threat level as normal. However, smaller eruptions, hydrothermal explosions, or even new fumarol fields forming are all within the realm of possibility over the coming years. Russia's Krasheninikov volcano roars to life after 600 years. In a stunning geological coincidence or perhaps a deeper planetary pattern Krasheninikov volcano in Russia's Kamchatka Peninsula erupted for the first time in over 600 years just days after a massive 8.8 .8 magnitude earthquake struck the region. The eruption sent a towering plume of ash 8 kilometers into the sky and blanketed nearby mountain slopes in volcanic debris. The volcano had shown no signs of activity since the 1400s, making this eruption both historic and alarming. This eruption may have been triggered by the earthquake, noted Dr. Ivan Mikhailov of the Kamchatka Volcanic Eruption Response Team, KVERT. The seismic energy could have disturbed ancient faults or destabilized magma pockets. This Eruption, although not directly linked to Yellowstone, underscores the interconnectedness of Earth's tectonic and magmatic systems. Are we entering a new era of global volcanic activity? Some scientists theorize that we may be entering a phase of increased global geologic turbulence driven by shifts in tectonic plate stress, glacial melting and crustal rebound in polar regions, deep mantle plume cycles heating volcanic hotspots from below, volcanoes once thought dormant for millennia like Krasheninikov may reawaken, 